Hear ye, hear ye, the great Grox Destroyer has come to our humble village. You will give him your utmost attention. That is all. God bless. So, there was a clip that I did. A actual full, you know, 10, 11 minute episode. Show you guys, and then Camtasia freaked out. Had a weird bug. I clicked it again, and it kind of blew the entire recording away. So, this is now the 21st episode. Um, we did some stuff um, off camera. Now, now off camera. Um, stabilized Terra Score got T3. I'm about to place down my third colony on this planet. Which, by the way, is the maximum that you can have per planet that is that has not been through civilization stage. So let's see. We have this spice geyser and this spice geyser. Yep, yep, we can do it there. So also grab some new allies, which is nice. Because look at the amount of purple spice that is being churned out of this thing. At like 20 spice per minute. It's insane. Um, what else? Um, I guess those are the main things that I did. Um, oh, and I'm going to terraform. Actually, I don't need to do that anymore because I bribed them. Never mind. I... I got, I got a terraforming thing for someone, but I just realized that I don't need that because I just give them a huge gift of money and they like me more. Um, these guys. They were actually starting to attack me and then I gave them money and they really like me now. So that will be interesting. Who should I trade to? Um, you know what? Not my problem. Um, let me see. Who did I give this to? I think, I think I gave this purple spice to these guys last clip and got tons. Yeah. Okay. Watch this. Boom. One trade. It's amazing. Um. Sure. For my blue spice planet, maybe. I don't know. Yay, I got a new um, badge thing down here. So I'm like, if you measure space sage by this, I'm like halfway. Um, it does get exponentially harder, by the way. And this is like, yeah, so this little slang scale here with your spaceship. So this is where the Grox is, and this is where home is. So imagine it as basically a measuring stick from your home to here to out to here. So I, I think the game was designed to basically find the Grox since you have this sliding scale here. I'm back and I just thought I'd tell you that I can get stuff now like mini bomb, laser, better health. And I don't even have to look for better prices because I have so much purple spice that's coming out here. Look, you can probably see it change. No? No? Okay, fine then. Fine then. As soon as I saw... See, there. There. It went from three to four. That's how fast they're taking spice out of the ground. It's amazing. Let's go over to our favorite loyal customers here at um, Stupid Pathetic Planet of Red Spice. And they actually like Blue Spice as well. That's nice, but they like Purple Spice a bit more. There we go. Oh, let's get Mini Happy Ray, by the way. That, that makes, like, if you shoot Mini... If you shoot a happy way at a city, um, 
people will like you better, including the Grox. It does work on the Grox, and it's actually essential for befriending the Grox. If we decide to do that. By the way, comment section, befriend or destroy the Grox. What do you think? You don't even probably know what the Grox are yet. Um... How about no? Okay, I did give that to these guys because, you know, they have the purple spice planet. And I really, really want that. But some random dudes over here couldn't care less. So now I have a mini bomb. And let me see what other things I can buy. I can also buy from Orbit. Oh, have food and Ralph Triolio. Oh, 